Hank Brown. We're coming to you from downtown Jonesboro, Tennessee. We're on October 28th. We're gonna have the Haunted Half Marathon right here in Tennessee's oldest town. So I'm right. I'm here with Melinda Cop, and Melinda, this Melinda is the director of Main Street Jonesboro. Tell us about Jonesboro for someone that's coming here from out of town, never been. Here. Yeah, well, we are Tennessee's oldest town, like you said. We were founded in 1779. We are very well preserved. We've got a lot of really neat buildings, really neat shops, and eateries. So yeah. make sure to come and spend the weekend in Jonesboro and check out everything that we have to offer. We're also the storytelling capital of the world. So be sure to make a weekend out of it. Um, grab a historic town tour. Um, you can grab a carriage ride. There's lots of things that you can take in for the weekend. Yeah, so where history comes alive right here. And so, uh, so what does a race like the Haunted Half Marathon, what does that mean coming to Jonesboro? Well, it's, it's a huge economic boost when anything like this happens for a town. Um, we already host the Storytelling Festival, so we are used to catering to events and having people come to us. So we're so excited to have a running group come to Jonesboro and to be able to host everyone and, and show them what we're all about. We have a lot of great B&Bs mm -hmm. and the historic Eureka Inn along with Country Inn and Suites. So make sure to grab your room and just make a weekend out of it. And we're also going to offer lots of Halloween activities throughout the day after the marathon with our um, Halloween Haunts and Happenings event. So make sure to, to uh, see what's going on and, and be up to date with what all we're going to have to offer that weekend. Yeah, and we're going to expect to see some real ghost stories going on right here. A lot of haunted running on October 28th, the Haunted Half Marathon. Thank you, Melinda. We're going to go on the course tour, so let's get to it. <music> Rose, this is my running partner, Rose Hi. and Hoss. We just came up Hawes Hill. Well, that was tough, wasn't it? Yeah, and you said, he, when we were coming up, you said, let's name that the Haunted Hill. Yeah. But it's the biggest one I've seen on the whole course so far. Yeah, I think that's gonna be our toughest hill. But we're up it, we made it. Yep. Nice neighborhood, right? Very pretty, very pretty. All right, let's keep going. Okay.
All right, now we made it to, this is Golden Oak Park. It's a beautiful neighborhood. Yeah, it's a cool neighborhood. We just went through a lot of nice homes and really Very well nice. kept your hearts and everything. Really nice. Very scenic. Yeah, and this is also going to be the exchange zone for the second leg and the fourth leg runner. So it's a nice little park. Uh, it's part of this neighborhood. And where you can see we're on a trail. We're going to run through this trail into the next neighborhood, make a little block and come back right back here, right behind us, and then head that direction back into Jonesboro. So, ready to roll? Yeah! Let's go! We just came from the back of that neighborhood on downhill on the trail, wasn't it? It was wonderful. Awesome? That was awesome. And you don't have to worry about traffic, and there's like shade for a little while, and it gets yeah. dark. It's awesome. Yeah, we went underneath the highway. It almost got pitch dark, you know. <laughs> That'll make it haunted, too. <laughs> yeah. A haunted tunnel, huh? Yeah. <laughs> so, and it's all downhill, a little bit flat, but it's a nice relief from uh, the hills we just ran. So For sure. that's a great breakup right there. We really needed that. Now we're getting ready to go and run around Wetlands Water Park. Oh Dad, boy! Never seen that. Have no, you? I didn't even know it right, existed. So more adventures. Okay, Rose, we just came up for Snowman Ridge. That's a pretty tough hill. Kind of reminds me of Taylor Street. Yep, in Bristol, Bristol, if any of you have done the Bristol half, of course, yeah. Bristol Peeps. Kind of a long, gradual, and then go a little steep here at the end. 
but we're staying on the trail that's what off the main road. That's what's important. I like that we're off the main road and on this trail. It's yeah, neat. and we're near the top. Once we get actually to the top, downhill, long way, all nice. the way to downtown. All uphills have a down. <laughs> yeah. All right, you ready to keep going? Yeah. Oh, that's good. So Rose, we just came down a really long hill, Cinder Ridge. That just was fantastic. You need it. And the second time around, that's going to be the last mile. So you're going to be going downhill. That's great. To the last mile, and you hit this trail. And it takes is, all the way back to town. It's flat. This whole course has been just so scenic. Even though it's a little challenging, there's some hills. It's beautiful. It's going to be great. Check out this behind us here. Isn't that beautiful? I mean, can and you this, meet the view? And Natalie calls this a lagoon. <laughs> Beautiful swan right there, so. All right. Here we go. Ready to keep going. Almost done. All right, almost. Day we'll do it. Everyone else will do it. Uh, love this finish downtown. With, uh, and and the storytelling fun. center, the courthouse, all these shops and cafes. It's all going to be shut down for this festival. It's going to be great. Yeah. yeah. So thank you. We had thank a great you. time. What a variety on this course. Isn't Big it? time, like neighborhoods, trails. All kinds of stuff. It's unlike anything I've ever experienced. I didn't know anything about Jonesboro, so now I look at it completely different. Yeah, that cool. was an adventure. Haunted Tunnel. Oh yeah, we, we discovered something. Haunted Hills in that one first neighborhood. Haunted Tunnel and Natalie's Lagoon. Natalie's we ought to put little signs. Yeah, we got it. <laughs> so, right. I liked it a lot. Thank, thank you, you, Hank. All right. Thank you, Jake Van Hus. We're all filming us all day. <laughs> all right, that's a wrap.